نحمد و نسلی علی رسول الكریم السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ السلام علیکم السلام
So Allah give you alm in your in your head, inshallah. <laughs> but on your name. Sister Javeria. Sister Javeria. That rhyme with two Y's. Sister Javeria. Okay, I think we forgot. We raise hands when we need to speak, right? So hold on and let's just quickly go through. I'm still hoping that Abdullah comes in. And you have the book open and those who are reading, they can certainly read. So Aviv and Azmina have not yet joined, right, Sister Kamara? Azmina, Ari, Musa, and Abdullah. Now, before we start we, with your question comments, I hope that I see that smile, which is very important, other than the books and everything. Look at Nina, mashallah. I feel so happy seeing Bayan, mashallah. Good job. Excellent. Awesome. Now, the text prompt is open, so you don't have to hurt your hand keeping it up for a long time. My text is open, and I like the way Lena E shared that on my summer, I talked with my friends for two hours, so that is beautiful. It's a great time to catch up with family and friends, right? So, Erin, how is grandma doing? Um, very, very bad. Oh, hasbi Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave her shifa. So what she are you doing? Hmm? What are uh, you doing for her? Making du'as. Wow, mashallah. Um, mm -hmm. can I tell something? Yes, go ahead. Um, she's my dad's mom mm -hmm. and she mm -hmm. forgot all of us. Alhamdulillah. Give her health and quick recovery. And now, can I say something that what I did in the fall break? Mm -hmm. I went to my cousin's house and then <clears throat> first I ate food and then my cousin let 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 me play on her phone and then and then I gave it back to eat um desserts and. And then, and then I played with kids and went back home. And guess what iPhone is, is her phone? Okay. Guess the iPhone. Okay. Yes, Bayan, thank you for writing that. You can still keep on typing there, right? We can still read there. Alhamdulillah. Now, when you are in the fall break, what is something that you can do that you can be really happy looking back at right so everybody can tell me what they did in the chat box it's right there and farhan go ahead something ha very sad happened uh oh this saturday uh-huh oh. is everything okay my my great great grandma died we all belong to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We all return to Allah my, subhanahu wa ta'ala. So is she, is, was she here in Atlanta? No, she's in India. She was she's in, my she was she's my dad's my dad's mom's mom. I see, I see, I see. So you can make dua for her. Rabbi Rahmahumma Kama Rabbayani Sagira. And you know what? It's a temporary separation. When somebody passes away, they go and then, inshallah, we will see them soon in Jannah, right? So let us all raise hands and make dua that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reunite us with all the loved ones in the highest level of Jannah, okay? And I really want to meet with my family and everybody that, you know, we love at next to the river of Kaul which is going to be whiter than milk and sweeter than honey and there will be beautiful tents over there and there will be so many cups over there inshallah Allah help us get together there and then we all go in Jannah together okay a lot of question comments today we have a jam-packed agenda so but let me have those things out of your way so go ahead Danish uh, Sister Javeria, yes. sorry, uh, I just saw the message uh -huh. in the classroom. Danish, uh -huh. one, one second. Uh, let's just remember if I can. Yes. Zoom is not working. I just saw the message on Google uh, Classroom. Are you able to respond to it? Like, are you able to respond to it? Letting them know that there's everybody's in. I don't know why there's, there's a problem there. Zoom for today is not working. Okay, Haskella, because there's all of us are here. Now she is in, Azmina is in, so I hope it works. In Arabic, last class, he was there. Okay, okay, inshallah. Let me see if I'm able to reply and tell them to just re log maybe. Uh, I said something in the yes, chat. Yes, I did. I'm seeing that. Alhamdulillah. Uh, <laughs> okay, all right. So, Danish, yes, you were saying something? <laughs> Uh, 
your voice is not coming very clear, Danish. Either move closer, move your lid down. Sister, may I be able to make a? Sorry? Did, were you make, able to understand Danish? No, oh, Danish, I remember. He said. Still alive, right? That's what you said? Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Friends, anybody whose you know, place is like squeaky, just keep it mute so that everybody else can hear. All right, so let us begin with dua so that we can see our agenda for the day. We have a loaded day. So let's stretch your arms. <laughs> In the name of the most those friends whose hands were in the dua form, right? Danish, at this time we do thumbs up or if you do dua hands. Hmm? So in the meantime, I need to see dua hands. And Zishan, I'm observing how we are doing, right? So please, your name needs to be spelled correctly, right? So that we can do that. Now, this knowledge has to be beneficial knowledge, right? And alhamdulillah, who wants to say this dua? Go ahead, Maryam. I have a, I, can I drink water? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Make sure that you usually try before the class, right? And Lita, should I add to the checklist that your name should be correct? Are you a chicken nugget? No, right? So we want to, option number one, we want to act smart or we want to act funny. Which one are you choosing when you arrive in this class? Hmm? Act smart, right? Act smart. Alhamdulillah. When we learn so much better. We need to act smart. So, inshallah. Sister Mara, I will add like co host option there because some mics I think they need some adjustment as we are together. So, let me see what game I am. It's right there. So, I think if you, you, you have the co host option, so inshallah we can adjust the microphone so that we can make the best use of our time. So, let's say this together, friends. Allahumma inna. We ask you for knowledge that is good and for provision that is good and for action that will be accepted. Hasbina, is everything good? Yes. Can I read the dua by myself? You can, yeah. but let's go ahead and do this one. We all should be knowing this one by now. We have done this so many um, times. Go ahead. <laughs> Now, I am so proud of those friends who are sitting very crisp and nice, mashallah, but some friends need reminders. Their defense shield is still not strong. So, Zishan, I really want you to uh, say ta'awuz one more time. Please put the ball away and no moving around, okay? Inshallah. So, put the ball away and focus with us, inshallah, okay? So, you know what, Shaitan, we say it, a'udhu billahi minash shaitan rajim, but he still tricks some of us. So, we need to have our strong, strong, strong defense shield. Right? Oh. Alhamdulillah. Now, you have the annotate option, and let's see, where are we today? What date are we on today? And you have one minute to show me your printed salah chart in the screen right now. Special ticket for the first person who shows me their printed salah chart in the screen. Your challenge starts right now. So you are annotating on the screen for the date. And then you're showing me your Salah chart on the screen. So your time starts right now. MashaAllah, Lina Chase. Good job, Fazal. Excellent. And I'm at my grandparents, so I don't have my Salah chart. Okay. 
all right so i hope it like next time when you pack like clothes or your pjs or your toothbrush you can always take your salad chart with you so let's see who is gonna get the ticket today for showing me the salad chart yes mariam mariam do you want to say something in the guru i want a ticket say it again mariam i didn't uh, mind my, out because i could my, i didn't see the assignment okay but look at that some of your friends saw it and they are on time lamise what friend, happened to your defense shield lamise are you okay he's trying to trick you and you are getting tricked what's happening i'm okay so we were telling you to get salad chart not your laundry basket <laughs> I, so you need to get up sit properly and there you go i saw fazal was first one and then i saw farhan as the second one farhan can you bring it closer i saw fazal's one mashallah fazal ones was marked my, all my day. ink um on my ink my printer ink was bad but um mm -hmm. it shows it a little bit very good mashallah so you have four options here right So, what option are we choosing? That's a really important difference, right? I think all of yes, yes, Farhan. I paid all of the salas mm -hmm. till um till November thirtieth, but I forgot to like it. Okay. Okay, so yeah, that's so why. Yeah, that's why we need to put our salah chart in a certain special place so that we don't forget it. And when you print the salah chart, it has so many benefits. Why? Because it has something really nice at the back of the salah chart as well, right? And it's very important that you know we discuss that with our family and we make the most of it. Again, you know what? These reminders are there, but if you don't take action. then it's not going to be beneficial for us right because knowledge demands action so five times a day allah subhanahu wa taala tells us hayya la sala come to sala in hayya la fala come to success but some of us we say oh you know what let's wait let's do it so again it's all depend on choices that we are making whatever choice you're going to make that's what's going to you're going to get if you prayed alone that's that's a choice that's a check mark if you pray in salat al jama your on the day of judgment you will see 27 times reward for that same time and if you prayed late it's better than not praying at all but if you're making this choice for every salah that's what you are making right and that's what you will be answerable for so let's be very careful as to what choice am i making right so go ahead lock on your fingers or give me a thumbs up a muslim should pray what do you think how many times a day how many times a muslim should be praying yes so a high five to all of you inshallah and right now sitting here let's take a deep breath and say to allah subhanahu wa taala allah subhanahu wa taala sometimes it may be hard for me to pray but now inshallah i am 7 and more anybody in my classroom who is 6 years old you can unmute 7 years old hmm i'm 7 oh, oh I'm then why are we rumbling and tumbling in class i don't know i may i may i may sister humaira let's I'm see eight. who is a smart 7 years old who is sitting so nicely and crisply right masha allah they are enjoying their sitting their desk is all good their materials are all good and nice i can show you i have a desk cuz i'm sitting on the ground and why is that lovis why are you sitting on the ground where is where is you? why are you sitting here It's a choice that you made to sit here, right? So, can you move yourself to a place where you can sit more comfortably, and your book and workbook is with you, right? So, comfortable. I can work like this. Okay. So, but I, I really would like, like, look at that. Some of my friends are sitting so nicely, and it's so nice to see, mashallah, how fit they are. And you know what? Now, all right, fine. Yes. So, inshallah, let's make smart choices on salah chart and in our life as well. make smart choices right so here at the back of the salah chart so sister hamara we noted down we have fazl and i will give one to farhan as well for his salah chart mashallah right and friends lock on your fingers that i will print myself bayan there you go mashallah is that the new salah chart rabi usani 
Yeah, I just printed it you because printed I didn't get a chance. Okay, excellent. Alhamdulillah. And I didn't find it before the trip in the okay. classwork. Okay, it's in the notes section. If anybody needs it, it's always in the notes section. If you don't find it, I am a call or mail away. Sister Romero is there. If you need any help, we are there. Yes, Fazil. Um, on my solar chart, um, on the back there, um, there isn't any, there isn't any okay. compassion or. Okay, Fazal, you know, thank you so much for sharing that. I am so proud of you being so consistent with it. When we started the month in the very beginning, I was still waiting for a meeting with Dr. Mispa to finalize that what is the theme we want to follow for the whole month. So that came in a little bit late. So that's why then I when as soon as we decided that this is going to be a month for compassion, then I added the back also there. Okay. So if you open it up now, you will see the back okay. and you can just print that out if you like. Okay. Or you can draw with your own hands at the back of the things. Now everybody show okay. me your two hands. Can you show me your two hands, everybody? Show me your brave to me with your two hands. Now get ready. It's compassion is empathy and kindness in action let's see who can do that one two three compassion is empathy and empathy. kindness in action kindness and action very good mashallah you can say i'm a very compassionate person but then if you're not doing it then that's not being compassionate right so compassion is empathy and kindness in action so I really miss when we were in classrooms, the hugs and, you know, the being there for each other. Now I'm going to give you an example. You know, this morning when my husband and my son, they were driving back from the masjid after Fajr. It was so windy. Can you guys all move like a wind? It was like so windy. And they were going and a car was in front of them good job mariam excellent mashallah there you go it just takes a quick printout and there you go you have it mashallah and i like that you have the colors on it too excellent so you can mark it till now okay now what happened the car ahead of them a big giant tree fell down on it on the car and they stopped the car and this, they went and they, that was a lady driving. The car. Yes, yes Lamise. Let me do you know my teeth fell out right here? Yeah, but I do not need to see a hand when you want to speak, right? So that I can, Wait, can you, give proper attention. Can you say that again? Yeah, that's why, Lamise, I'm reminding. Just raise your hand when you need to speak. Just like Ryan has raised his hand, right? So now what happened? They got off and alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, that the tree fell on the, the, tr the front part of the car. And just a little bit behind was the windshield and this lady sitting in the car. And she was safe, alhamdulillah. But this was a big, giant tree that fell down. So they, they went and they asked her if she's okay. And she was like, you know, she was like so worried. And it just happened moments ago. But you know what she said when she called her husband? He said that is the car okay? Is the car totaled or not? Right? And she was like, you know what? What, what is more important? What is more important? The car or her? What do you think? Hey. Hmm? Her. Her. Her is important, right? Okay. So compassion is kindness and empathy in action. May Allah SWT help us ask for each other, right? So okay. today, I, I would like you when you will be done with your work and you go downstairs or you are with your family, ask everybody, how are you doing? Okay? How are you doing? How are you feeling? Yes, One Ryan. time, I... Um, one time there was a hurricane mm -hmm. and like a lot of trees fell down right. and some of them are like still falling down. Yes, that's true. So Sarah, at any time anything happens, compassion is that you uh, offer uh, your hands to help. No, no, sister, no, no, no. Zishan, we don't, Zishan, we don't raise our hand and start talking at the same time. So compassion hands are very caring hands, right? And Rayan also, his hand was first like this, and then his hand went like this and this and this. That's not compassion, my friend. That's not compassion. You know, because we cannot have, you know, 15 people speak at the same time. So let's do one more last time for the compassion first. And if you really have something that you need to say, be compassionate. Go ahead and type it in the chat box. 
Help and me up I want to type. Help me your typing fingers. I want to like up say type. it. I want to say it. Yes. I want to like say it. Awesome. So, there was a storm. Zishan, first you need to fix your name. There was a storm with a tornado and yeah. a tree. Zishan, Zishan can you focus with me? I need you to fix your name first, okay? And show me your typing hands. You can even type. You, nobody has to stress out in the class. You can always type whatever you're feeling. I can see your comments. I am getting them. And I'm really happy those who focus, right? Alhamdulillah. Now, let's say it one last time, friends. Compassion is kindness and empathy in action. And we will see who would like to share in assembly as well about compassion, right? And I am so proud of you guys. Mashallah, last week I gave you work, you know, for assembly. We will share something. Um, and I said that we were going to share for three minutes. Some of your videos were a little bit smaller, right? So anybody has any reflection after watching all those videos, anything you want to say about those videos that, you know, in assembly every Monday, my smart um, second graders, you are going to be sharing something with the whole class. That's also like passionateness and in action. You can choose a topic that we did before or anything extra as well. So for the first coming the next Monday, I need a name today. Who would like to present in the coming Monday assembly? Okay. So if you want to be the one, you can type in chat box that yes, I, this, I want to present. This is my idea. And then I will talk to you more in detail after the class. Okay. We will talk more about it as to what we will do. But everybody will be presenting. Okay. Inshallah. So now raise your hand if you have any reflection from the sharings that friends did on Flipgrid regarding the the, uh, the videos that you did. So amazing, incredible effort. So proud of your work. I started Mashallah. out. Lucky, um, like, I watched a couple of videos, but huh? I don't remember them. Huh? But I want to talk about something else. Um, I just want to ask you. Um, was my video shorter than three minutes? Uh, your video, you can all see the timings. You can always see, each one of you can see the timings of that. Okay? So let me bring it forward for you guys so that you can remember. And let's say this together. R E R E A D R E T S E. So when you read, you will see that all the instructions are laid out, you know, very clearly here. here right so that way you can see how things are so there was like beautiful beautiful videos some of you went inside and left comments for each other so that was amazing when you guys go in you see each other's and then you even put a comment then that's really nice because you're helping each other right sometimes we make multiple things so it's better to make just one which is like fruitful right which is something that is better so here are all these videos, and uh, let's see who wants to, who still remembers them, and who still wants to share any thought that came to your mind that this was really nice, or this I really liked, and this is what I want to <coughs> Who would like sister, to go? Uh, I would like yes, to go. Yes, Isha. Yes, sister. Are you, I may have liked, I may have liked it beyond. Abdullah said that he can't join the class. Maybe he's in the waiting room. Can you check one more time? Abdullah, Maybe. okay. Uh, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Yes, they are in the... No, they are... There is the waiting room. I disabled it. So, it's the waiting room is open. Like, there's so, no waiting room. Yeah, so I just saw the message that he said that uh, I can't join the class. Okay, so this is on the Google Classroom. Okay, so I am trying to go there. Go ahead, who, uh, Zishan, go ahead. You want to share? You can share while I try to help. Okay, uh, so I want to, like, see, like, uh, Beyond's. She, like, very good at the thing. Uh -huh. Yeah, I liked hers. Okay, I like yours, I like too. But you, you was just like, you know, sometimes when you're reading, if you prepare yourself a little bit before, then it can sound very natural, right? Versus just... 
You could do the top one, never mind. So, you know, you guys can still go ahead and you can... Okay, so let me see. Just give me one minute. I need to just re reply to Abdullah. Let please try again. Uh, we, can you guys all make dua for him too? That Allah make it easy for him to come inside the room. Right? And, um, and let, me, let me see who is reading from page number 81 meanwhile. Okay? And anybody wants to share any reflection, anything that you want to say regarding these videos? Uh, is Sister Javaria... Mm -hmm. I didn't see the two chats about my video. You did not see them earlier? Yeah, I didn't see them earlier. So I think I want to see them. Yeah, so you can always go back and see them. Now, I have another question with you. Who thinks that they did a great job? That's option number one. And option number two is, oh, I can improve upon it. I can make it more better. Lock your answers. Thank you, Lena C, for quick listening. Thank you, Fazil. Thank you, Mariam. Thank you, Farhan. Thank you, Bayan. Okay, Musa, I'm still waiting. Yes, Lamis? The one I did was all wrong. The one that you did was all wrong? That's okay. That's okay. I, you know what? I, I, I was thinking today was failure is failing to see the problem. Do you guys understand that? Once we see some problem, then it's very easy to fix it. But it's a great thing if you see that, oh, something is wrong and I need to fix it. And that is so, like, that's like, I'm so proud of you guys. I'm so proud of your tools that you locked as well that, oh, I can make things better. So Lena, definitely there were multiple recordings. You can always delete if something is not working out. You can always delete it so that everybody's time is saved, right? And uh, you know what? This one is still open. And for Monday assembly, for the wisdom sharing for the assembly you guys can still use it and go for it so i for now so far i have received bayan saying that i want to go i want to present so bayan we can put you down for this monday okay and i'm going to send an email to your mom your dad uh sister shabana sister humera and sister mispa that our star presenter for monday will be bayan from second grade sounds good yes and yes <laughs> Um, so, um, so am I just going to explain the video, what I, what I meant and what I'm trying to say? That's a great question, Bayan. We need to talk right after class, okay? So let's, let's okay. go to the learning project right now and right after class, just stay for a minute or two and I'm just going to explain. Uh, this is Javelia. Okay. This is Javelia. Uh oh, I don't take comment like that. I need to see a hand, then we need to see the permission to speak, and then we Daddy, can... Now, before I give permission, before I give permission, there is this praying to Raka Salah that we have to do. And that is on page number 81. So your reading challenge starts right now. And once you are done, you are going to give me a thumbs up on the screen that yes, I am done reading. That's yes, very good, Mariam. Good job showing me the page. That is Salah to Raka. Go ahead, Zisha. Now you can tell me. Your reading time starts right now with your reading stamina. Let's see. Zisha, you're muted. Very good. Farhan, get started. Yes. Zisha, you are mute. Uh, you need to unmute Zisha. Yeah, I have a doctor's appointment at one o'clock. Okay, so inshallah, our class will finish at 12.55. Do you want to leave right now, Zisha? Yeah, I think I want to leave right now because... Assalamu alaikum, Sister Jeruja. Assalamu alaikum, Sister Jeruja. The doctor's appointment at one o'clock, I was uh, thinking of waiting till like 12.50. Okay. Okay, inshallah. And what I will do is, Zishan, I'm going to upload the video of this class on uh, over there as well, okay, by tonight. So you, when you can come back, then tomorrow yeah. you can see the video as well, okay? And there are two chats. Yes, but right now I want you to read. Let's have these four minutes. Let's make use of them and open on page 81. Can you show me your book on page 81? Islamic Studies, page 81. And go ahead, uh... Azmina, you have your book in front of you? Go ahead. Can you read the first part for us, Azmina? Okay. 
Okay, so who is ready? Yasmina is still opening the page. Hmm, I like the way how Musab is reading, mashallah. Smart readers. Yes, Yasmina, go ahead and read, sweetie. Iraka is one unit of prayer. Below are the portions of positions. prayer so that yeah, positions, positions. Mm -hmm. differ slightly for girls. Okay, now, like, hold on there. You guys played a game with me last time, right? So let's see if you guys can do that. I'm going to say the position name and you're going to get in that position. Ready? So we are going to get in the Qiyam position. Hmm? How are we going to get in the Qiyam position? Or you get ready in the Salah position. So you're just standing. Okay, so that's very good. So Qiyam is when you have folded hands, when you have done Allahu Akbar. How do you say that? Allahu Akbar. Very good. Your hands all the way to the side. You can raise them up to your ears or a little bit below, but all palms facing the the Kaaba. Beautiful. MashaAllah. Excellent. Zishan, let's follow along. You can read, maybe take the book with you in the car and then you can read along. Okay, inshallah. Now, let's see. You fold your hands and you stand for Qiyam. Now, you know what Rasulullah told us that the boys and girls like pray similarly. Yes, so you can put your hands together and you see on the screen a little bit upwards hands and your one hand is on the other hand three fingers like on the side and you are standing like this beautiful mashallah most of you are doing amazing so this friday we will see how do you create two rakas now let's go into ruku how do you bow down and you go into ruku musab let me see you do it azmina musab let's see you guys do it how do you go in ruku beautiful excellent mashallah all right and at least i can't see you then let's stand back up from the ruku. Let's say Sami Allah right? And uh, you know Rasulullah would raise hands again like Rafaya then and then he would put his hands down. Now you go into a sujood. How do you go in sujood? Good job, mashallah. All right, when you go in a sujood, keep your, uh, you know, like little bit space between your belly and your, your feet. So it's like a little cat wants to go through or a little uh, goat wants to go through it can go through in between very good keep a little bit spacing right and hands on the side you can see on the screen. Uh, let me show you on the screen everybody come back and see on the screen right here look here there is some space if some small animal needs to go through it can just go through in between can you see that give me thumbs up if yes you can see that on the screen yes very good, mashallah. So you're not like your your hands and your uh, knees are not just tight this together. This is a very, I can see it on the screen. You can see them on the screen? Really? I hope you see takbir, qiyam, ruku. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me make it a little bit bigger for you. Okay, let me see if I can make it bigger for you so that at what point I'm trying to make you guys can see it bigger. Now, can you see it bigger? No. Okay. Sister Mera, are you able to see it? Yes. You are able to see it? Okay. Oh, I was doing it on the wrong one. Let me make it bigger here. Okay. Meanwhile, maybe somebody can show it by doing it as well. And let's see. Now you guys can see it bigger. Azmina, now you can see it? Yes. Okay, now you see what point I was trying to make? Mm -hmm. So you see that, you know, like your your hands and feet, they should be a little bit apart. So you, if there's like a small boat, it should be able to cross through. Does that make sense? Yes? And some people, you know, like not some people, actually a lot of people, they say that, oh, you know what, the females, they have to like really curl themselves up down and they have to be really close. But that's not correct. Rasulullah told us that pray as if you saw me praying. So for boys and girls, both, they need to keep that gap. And, you know, actually try it. You will feel it so nice. You will feel like a nice exercise. You will feel your belly having a nice, nice pressure on it. 
and it's such a beautiful exercise also now let's see after that you have, yeah, I... you have then you stand back up and then that's how you start in the next raga right let me see everybody in jalous how do how are you sitting in a jalous just like lamis is sitting right now in a jalous very good just like that mashallah excellent just like in a jalous right now okay excellent all right friends so let's come back inshallah and you can read now that you know like this is like one set of raqa when you stand up back again you go in qiyam then in ruku let's show these positions with our hands right now now okay so come back to the screens now and show me like with your ruku like you go like this then you stand up back in qauma then you go in sujood again right and then you sit back again jalsa then sujood again and then you sit down and that is called tashahud where you say at tahiyatu lillahi was salawat right and that's where you see this boy his eyes is on the finger like on the finger when you are in the the shahud so that's how we're going to do it so i'm going to send you some videos to watch as well inshallah so you can practice more tomorrow these two rakas and then this friday we will try to show what we know give me thumbs up if you are ready for a challenge to show that you can pray two rakas salah or no oh no i don't know how to pray two rakas salah or oh no i cannot do it at all oh my god sister humaira they are all so smart hmm i like the excitement so azmina's brother can maybe make a video of her doing it right now before i let you go who remembers what is the driving question for 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 this pbl what are we trying to do raise your hand if you know what yes go ahead maryam so we're making a map of our classroom uh -huh. we we'll label five things in arabic uh huh and the idea is to safely reopen that's that's what we're trying to see right yeah. alhamdulillah yeah. so from islamic studies perspective don't forget to say bismillah before you even start doing it right and even uh, you writing it so always remember to keep allah's name there bismillahir rahmanir rahim yes lena there's one minute to i always read um um Say, say it again, Lena. I'm always trying to recover. Masha Allah, I'm so proud of that, and that's what we will show. What we know, right? Inshallah, we will show it, and what we know, we will show it. Inshallah. Yes, Fazal. Uh, it's twelve fifty-five. I have smart timekeepers, Masha Allah, in this room, right? So one last thing that I want to tell you is that you guys, Masha Allah, know how to pray Salah. So that's what we will show on the Friday Salah. Maryam, that is so beautiful what you're working on the project. That's so cool. And don't forget to add Islamic studies element in it, and we will give you more details on that, right? So don't forget to say Bismillah. And you can always talk about the cleanliness part. Why we need to say say. So at the who? Shatrul Iman. How many of you can say that? Let's say it one last time. All. बैक and don't forget to give mom and dad a big hug so just so jazakum allah khair wa asalu jazaa for being here and uh, unless you have a question or bayan i want to talk to you about the pro the assembly and uh, the rest of you can inshallah go assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh fi iman allah and if there's anything missing you guys can complete it and make sure send me the evidence and i'll update the grade book inshallah all right so anybody has a question or should i speak with bayan now okay yes meena sweetie is meena just on mute sweetie Um, for that tomorrow assignment, what are we supposed to do? So the tomorrow assignment, Azmina, we will work on the workbook pages, okay? And on Friday we will show how do we pray two rakas. 
I think you should be able to. Okay? But I tried it. Yeah, but error. Can, yeah, but you can, find an error. Okay, but but the class is over, so now you can enjoy a little break so that you can then join your next class, inshallah. Okay. I printed out um the two things. Okay. Awesome. I'm so proud of that. But they're not colored. I don't have ink. Oh, you don't have ink. So you know what you can do is uh, you can always uh, you can always color it by yourself, right? So you can go ahead and you can color it and you can work on that inshallah. Okay, show me again and show me the, you know, I can show you from the screen that this, the back, show me the back side of it too. See, just like this, you can just color the yellow color in there, the heart you can Wait, could you please wait for a second so I can get a screenshot and color it? Yeah, it's there on your in your notes section also. So you can just download from there too, the color one will sh show it there. <laughs> Which color? Could I use all the colors that um I want? Yes, whichever you like, inshallah. Okay. All right, Jazakumullah khair. So, Bayan, for the assembly, inshallah, uh, you can mm -hmm. choose whatever topic you want to choose. Okay? It could be anything, okay. it could be anything that you did before as well. Like, um, you know, like, remember you made the tree also, such beautiful tree. Yeah. So, I want you to think I about... I have a story about compassion, but I want to say it in um, assembly, but um, I don't how I need to say it, but it's a very good story. I made up it. Okay, inshallah. So if you can share with me, then we can work on it, and then inshallah we can practice for the assembly. Okay. It is like a boy who came and he. Um, there was. Asmina, right now, sweetie, I think Bayan was talking. Let let her complete, inshallah. Okay. So for this Monday, uh, Bayan will do it, and next week if you want to do it, should I put you down for the next Monday, Asmina? That yes. Will, okay, so that will be December uh, 14th. Okay. This what? December what? 14th. December 14th. Yes, okay. So we will talk more about it next time, inshallah. So, Bayan, sweetie, I know you have a class next as well. So, inshallah, mm -hmm. I will send an email also. Okay. So, and then you decide. Okay. Right? Uh, lock your answers. Option number one or option number two. Do you want to do recording or you want to do live? Uh, I think I'll do live. Okay. Then the second thing is, do you already have an idea of what topic you want to discuss? No. no. So I want you to look at your book. So you can look into the book, Bayan. Uh, whatever you want to do, really, you can discuss about that. So I can present um, some things I've learned or um, some part of my life that um, has um, something get, like Islamic right. in it. Or right. Like for example, you can share with everybody how to make wudu, right? You already made a video uh, on that so you can even show everybody how you make wudu and tell everybody that they make a wudu very or I can make a story with an important lesson in it. Right, inshallah. And then let me know by tomorrow. Can if I do a set, then Okay. Okay. Sister Javaria, do you mean this Monday or next Monday? This Monday. Today Monday is over. So now the coming Monday is December 7th. Okay. So inshallah, you have like a few days. So let me know by, by Friday if you can let me know. Okay. So what you find like. Okay. Inshallah, I have a question for you. Asvina, but we wait for our turn. Do you see Lena, how her hand is raised up? Right? Okay. Yes. So, um, so Bayan, what you need to do when I send an email, you can still think about it. If you think you want to pre-record, you can do that. And then you can send it to Dr. Misfa as well. Or if you want to read it or say it in assembly, you can even do that. However, you okay. Sister Javaria, um, maybe on um, Saturday or Sunday, um, can we meet at like 3 o'clock? Uh,
um, at the same Zoom link we are in now, we um, so we can right talk now. about it. Yeah, we can even try, but even right now I have a class that I have to go now because I have a class starting in another 10 minutes. So, but inshallah, first let's make sure that you, uh, you know, use this time even that we have right now, right? So let's okay. focus on maybe wudu because everybody will really benefit on it, inshallah. So you can, okay. you can try on wudu or if there's some other topic you're doing, then let's email me, then we can take it from there, inshallah. Okay. Okay. All right. Yes, Lina. Uh, I have two things to say. Uh -huh. If I save up, I can, I can buy a Nintendo. My dad will buy me one, and I got a new bike. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. I hope you make use of it, inshallah. All right. So, Allah give us the best of both worlds. Jazakumullah khair for letting me know. Yes, Azmina, sweetie. Could could I rec where should I record it? The same thing that I showed you, the flip grid. You can record there. You see this wisdom sharing for assembly? Yeah. So you can even record here, inshallah, just like all the other friends have recorded. But I can't like I can't but it will like take to five minutes. So that's okay. Now you have three to four minutes you can use for assembly. You have all the instructions over here. So let's do R E A D read to succeed, okay? All right. Okay. All right. Then inshallah, you have a wonderful day ahead. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.